Hello everybody, I'm Nasty Mold and we have a great new beta update. I'm pretty happy about this and I think most players will be as well. We have a brand new item added to the shop and because of this, one of the shop items has become free. So this is the Style Bunny Slippers. This will not be free when it comes to the live game. Uh, it's just free for beta players at the moment. Oh, the time just changed. Special offer, Style Bunny Slippers. Hop into cozy comfort. So this is a really, really cute new shoe that has been added for the Days of Style. Really precious. So I'm going to show you what these adorable shoes look like with every single uh, outfit in the game. So you can decide whether or not you want to get it. And uh, let me just change it so it's nighttime once again. So I have set it to night and I've also put on the matching bunny hair accessory just because I could not resist. It's cute. Come on. I had to wear it. So let's check it out with all the outfits in the game, starting with the base game ones, of course. The uh, default outfits, we have the dress, looks very cute. The short pants, the slightly longer ones. Oh. It doesn't work super good with the baggy or long pants, unfortunately. That looks, that looks like jammies. No, that one has shoes. Nope, 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 nope. Too many shoes connected. Nope. There we go. I can put it on with the overalls. Adorable. And uh, this one here, the elder outfit. Nope, 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 nope. Too many shoes. Oh, we can put it on with the dress. I'm excited. And this one here. Cute. Aurora items. I think most of them don't have shoes, so... Or maybe all of them. Sorry if you can hear the wind howling. It is super loud right now. I kind of like the pink with the green outfit for some reason. That one has shoes, so no. That one has shoes, so no. Shoes, shoes. Oop. A studious monk, but still a fan of cute bunny things. We have the flower one, which is no. Oh, this one's going to be cute on the mischief jumper. Yes. No. And I think this is the final one. This outfit is coming with the days of style as well. Fortunately, it doesn't suit it super well just because the pants are very long. And we can't wear it with the actual bunny outfit, which is unfortunate, but it makes sense. And I love the pom-poms on the feet anyways. So that's definitely very cute. I love that they added it to the shop. It's a very optional purchase and they have substituted it for another item. So now if we speak with the Days of Style guide, the ballet slippers can be found in their inventory, which is awesome. That means they're gonna be in-game currency or event currency for this event. And that's great, honestly. There were a lot of complaints, including from myself, I'll be honest, that um, the ballet slippers were um, an in-app purchase for some reason. Even though a lot of spirits in the game have worn them in the past, we've seen them drain like Season of Dreams, and I think the uh, Hide and Seek Pioneer has them too. And for me, obviously this is personal preference, but I love all the in-game currency items coming during this event. They're almost better than the in-app purchase ones. They might even be better. So this is what the ballet slippers look like. Very cute. Uh, yeah, I'm wearing it with the dress. I feel like that's what I would probably wear it with most of the time. Adorable. We also have seen some minor changes to the Cure For Me Aurora emote that is coming with the Aurora Encore. This is going to be a free emote, we'll just have to get some event currency to unlock it. I'm just too busy skipping. So this here is the level 1 version and that means that the effects have been taken away on this one, which is what I pretty much expected. In the background you can hear the Cure For Me music playing. And then the level 2 version has the effects and the hearts when you stop the emote. So precious. One other change with the camera that players have noticed, and I'm going to use it quite a lot, is when we're holding the camera, we now have the record option in the bottom right available. So it's a little easier to actually record things. Now this record option is only available for iOS users, I'm pretty sure. So unfortunately this won't really be available to everyone, but for me and some content creators and players who take a lot of photos and videos, it will be super handy. Oh, what did I do? Hello! I put my tripod down in the weirdest angle. Oh! Ooh. I think I've found a bug. The recording disappeared and there's numbers there. I guess I'll have to, uh, 
write a bug report pretty soon. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it for this update. We have some brand new adorable bunny slippers, and we now have some free ballet shoes, which is pretty nice. That is all I have to share. Thank you guys so much, as always, for watching. I hope you're hyped. I know I am. I will see you all in the next video. Bye! See ya! Mwah, 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 mwah.